I didn't expect to live. I really did not. When I was 18, I, th I thought they were going to kill me. Whatever we had, money, jewelry, they took away. I wore a necklace. They took it like that and ripped it off my neck. I mean, those are memories. You, I was young. I was only 16. And the terrible memories. And then when they sent us, out, put us on trucks, they were already screaming and, and, and hitting in between. And we were not told where we are going. The only thing we could take was a, a suitcase, a knapsack, and a bag with food for three days. That's what we were told. When we got to, when we got to the station, the luggage went into the luggage car. We never saw it again. Now you go out of this house with a bag and, suit, and, and a suitcase. I mean, you have nothing left, just what you wear on your body. We were invited in 19, oh, I can't remember the dates now, but the first time they invited us. And we all were thinking, we don't want to go. Then they told us they want us to speak at a school to people. So I said, you know what, we should go because we are the witnesses, we have to go. And that's how we went. And we felt not comfort, not really comfortable, but the, the Germans at that point were so nice to us. It was, it was just heartwarming to see that, how they received us. I mean, be remembering how it was, and all of a sudden it's another generation. So the, we, we felt good when we left. When we were invited the second time, we already liked, liked to go because we knew they'd treat us well and they have an entirely different outlook now. But you have to have an open mind because some are just, no, don't believe it. I tell you something, you say it often enough, people do believe. It's just to say the same the other way around. Hitler said it often enough, how bad the Jews are, how dirty Jews are, I mean, you can't believe what they, what they talked and what they wrote. If you hear that all the time, even you get depressed because you know you are not that way. Well, we said when the world, after World War II, we said, this is the last war. And that's why, why we want to talk about it. You have to learn about it. What can happen from hate? When you see the hate, when you propaganda it. We, we don't learn, unfortunately. But I wish, I wish people would learn. And maybe some do.